our business is men, and men are not toxic, Colorado strip club sign raises ire. Deborah Dunafin knew that a big sign outside her strip club that read toxic masculinity welcome here could land her in trouble. But she thought it needed to be said on behalf of her clientele and men everywhere, who she says have been given a bad rap in the news lately. Read more following the link in the video description. Number of Colorado newborns addicted to opioid surges. Colorado Springs, Colorado, the Colorado Health Department says the number of newborns in the state addicted to opioids jumped 83 percent from 2010 to 2015. The department says the state's rate climbed from two births out of 1,000 to 3.6 births in that five-year period. Read more following the link in the video description. Colorado could soon officially make truckers a part of the fight against human trafficking. Truckers have long been the eyes and ears of the road, and the industry and Colorado lawmakers want to officially put that perspective to use as the state continues its growing battle against human trafficking. Read more following the link in the video description. <music> CSU basketball steps up its game and win over rival Colorado. Never mind that 3-4 start to the season. Read more following the link in the video description.